Most people pass through some bad days and might interact with cops for different reasons. I am not intoxicated. I literally am not. I literally came out to be not intoxicated. My name is not ma'am. My name is Marcella. <laughs> But what happens when some drunk women's behaviors ignite in from of the law enforcement? Here are three cases for when this happened, starting with Case 1. On January 11, 2023, officers were called to address an intoxicated woman trespassing at a winery. Well, the owners here want you gone from their property. That's okay. fine. I didn't even do anything. Okay, so they've been closed I'm... for a while, and they're requesting that you um, That's leave fine. the property. That's fine. Um, you've been drinking? Um, yeah. This is drinking property. That's fine. I'm not judging. I'm just asking because you can't drive if you've been drinking, right? Is there um, someone we can call that can come pick you up or? Yeah, she was going to get me an Uber. Okay. Uh, can I see your driver's license? Yeah. Thank absolutely. you. Who, who's getting you an Uber? Uh, Ken, who owns the property. Do you know her? Yeah. Okay. I do know her. Okay. I'm just asking. Yeah. I don't know these things, right? That's why I'm asking. Okay. Perfect. Thank you so much. Give me just a second. Okay. Okay. Do you know how far away the Uber is? No. They called it, ma'am. The owners called the Uber? What is your name? I'm Deputy Cabrera. I don't because they called it. Okay. So we need to figure that Can out, you... right? Leave that flashlight out of my face. Thank you. It's not in your face. It's down here. I need to be able to see. I'm asking you to It's not leave. in your face, ma'am. I'm not doing this with you. Doing what? So, I'm not doing anything wrong. You're trespassing. They want you gone from their property. I'm ready to go in the Uber. Okay. Thank you. Well, they called me and they trespassed you. Thank you. I know the owner. Okay. okay. That's great. Can I have my license back now? Thank you. Well, your trespass first. First, here you go. You can have that back. Thank you. You're welcome, ma'am. Um, okay. No, you're welcome. Oh. Actually, you're okay. welcome. Okay. Because you're harassing me now. How am I harassing you? I'm trying to figure I out how to... I ask you to step off. I'm having a conversation with you. Thank you. Thank you. You're step welcome. Step off. Stop I'm, off. Ma'am, we need to figure out how to get you out of here. Ma'am... My name is not ma'am. My name is Marcella. Okay, Marcella. Right, we need to I'm figure out. I'm not ma'am, and they got the Uber. I'm not ma'am. I'm Marcella. Okay, Marcella. Thank you. So let's figure out this Uber, right? Because they want you off your property. Absolutely. So give me a second and let I me wanted. get that figured out for you, okay? So basically, um, okay. Okay. when I, yeah, so when I pulled up the, the male subject said that she had turned on the car and that um, I think she was in the driver's seat. But when I pulled up to the window, she had to like, I don't know if she moved over or what, but she was already on the passenger seat with the car off. So, yeah, basically she's saying that they called it. The encounter portrays a nuanced scenario where the woman, clearly inebriated, is approached by law enforcement with patience and respect. Despite her hostile demeanor, the officers remain composed, seeking to ensure her safe departure. They offer assistance multiple times, proposing solutions such as calling an Uber or contacting her daughter for transportation. This is that I advise you to leave me the F alone. You can't right advise now. me to do that. What I'm oh, advising yes, you I to can. do is yes, get I on can. your phone and call yourself an Uber. Okay. Go can home you before you me? get this and before yeah. you get yourself in yep. any worse situation. Oh no, on. there's no worse situation. Marcella, you've been there's trespassed nothing. from here. Okay, we can't leave until you leave. Call somebody. I'm gonna call somebody. Okay, so you call shut somebody. the door. You shut the door. We're not closing the door, Marcella. Listen. You will listen, close the door. We're listen not closing here. the door. Deputy Ramirez has told I'm you you've been trespassed right from here, okay? So here's they the deal. Called you are currently from... trespassing. Okay. Okay, guys, so I need you to no, make I'm arrangements done. to leave. I'm done. Because if I you refuse to do so, you will be arrested leave. for trespassing. Leave? We're giving you two door. options. Either call somebody or you're gonna go to jail tonight. Oh, I'm not going to jail. Okay, call somebody. I'm calling somebody. All okay, right. please do. So, move. We're not moving and we're no, not No, I want to make sure that you get on the phone with someone and I can confirm they're coming here. Move. Now. I'm not moving. I have a legal authority to be right here. Yeah, you have no legal I do. Yes, authority. I, do. I think it's, like, 
gross your legal authority. Okay, well, if you have a problem with that, you can call my sergeant when this is done yeah, and you can I will. happily complain. Yeah, about I that. will, because you're definitely harassing me okay. right now. Okay. I have been harassed right now. What was your name? Deputy Officer? Adams. Okay, well, I'm taking video of you. Definitely. You can request Adams. my video. No, right here, if I, you'd like. I'm definitely taking video of all of you. Okay. For would you please me. would you please call someone and then you can videotape us? I'm being very patient right now, ma'am. So please oh, start calling I'm somebody. I'm being patient too. What are you going to do? Well, I'm going to give you a reasonable amount of time to call an Uber. Yeah. And then okay. I'm going to tell you that if you don't call an Uber, I'm going to tell you you need what to leave now. Do? And if you refuse to walk away, you will be arrested for trespassing. I'm not going to do any of that. So, so you're refusing to call an Uber? Nope, not at all. I'm calling Uber right now. Great. Harassing me. Be right back. Hi there. How's it going? Hi. Good. Howdy, howdy. Who's the owner? I am. You are. Yeah. Okay. Um, so you want to trespass for two years. Um, you guys called an Uber and canceled it. Um, she is giving us the runaround and doesn't want to call herself an Uber. Um, is this something you want to do or you don't have to? There's no obligation for you to call an Uber. If she doesn't call an Uber, we've told her she's... However, tensions rise as the woman becomes more confrontational, rejecting cooperation and verbally abusing the officers. This situation underscores the challenges faced by law enforcement when dealing with individuals affected by substance abuse. Please get, get them nope, you're off me right now. Stop your purse. Stop your purse. What are you doing? Stop you're under your arrest. No, I am not. I did not do anything. No, I did not. Oh. You guys good here? Yeah. Hey, come back in. Uh, yeah. Um, Kim, Kim. Oh, okay. Oh, here's, okay. The So, um, she was, is this? Her daughter. Okay. Um, my name is Deputy Adams with the Sheriff's Office. So we told your mother that we that you had called her a taxi. She wasn't very receptive to that, but nonetheless, she said she was going to wait. Um, when she got out of her car, she decided to walk away, which is fine. But then she got into the face of one of my deputies, um, and when asked to step away from that deputy, she refused to. Um, and so now she is going to be under arrest, okay? Okay. We, uh, we tried to be reasonable with her. Um, once she started getting into the face and basically chest bumping one of our deputies, um, yeah. that was kind of enough. So she's going to be arrested for trespassing. Um, if she would have walked away, we'd have just made sure she went to the street and everything would have been fine. But um, yeah, she no. she pressed I the mean, issue. Honestly, this is at the point where like these types of things, maybe this is a rude awakening call for her, but she can't be acting like that. Mm -hmm. So maybe this is the best option. Do you think it would be beneficial for her to talk to someone from mental health? Yeah, I do actually. Okay. Well, what I'm going to do is put in a request for that to happen. They'll get a copy of this report and what we've spoke to your mom about and us speaking to you. Um, yeah. And we'll see if they can't talk to her. I, I obviously I can't guarantee that it'll help, but um, maybe it'll put her in contact with some people that can help. It highlights the importance of handling such encounters with empathy and professionalism as officers strive to balance public safety with understanding the complexities of mental health and addiction. If you thought this woman got herself doomed, then you haven't seen this one. Case 2, on December 17, 2023, a woman was exhibiting signs of drunkenness. Thus, she was pulled over by law enforcement. Refusing to comply with requests to step out of the car, she engaged in erratic behavior, slurred speech, and failed to understand her rights when read to her. If you're intoxicated, we don't want you behind the wheel of the vehicle. I am not intoxicated. I literally am not. I literally came out to be not intoxicated. Okay. I don't want to do this. I don't. You guys are so not cool. I'm sorry? What's your name? Angelique. Angelique. Like, like what, 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 what? I'm just trying to ask you what your name is. I'm not stupid. At no point have I ever said that you were stupid. 
You never did, no. Nope. But this is still definitely stupid. Well, I guess we'll see. I smell the odor of alcoholic beverages coming from your person. That's why I asked you to pull over here, right? No, you didn't. I actually pulled over by myself. After I told you to pull over. I pulled over. Okay. I pulled over. Sure. Larry? What, what, who's coming? Who's coming? Another deputy. Let's Corporal, talk. actually. Who, who's coming? Let's talk about who's coming. Larry? Who's Cor coming? Corporal Schwartz. I don't okay. know anybody named Larry. McCullough. Okay. That's great. That's great. What's That's great? That's great. This, this, this isn't happening. That's great. That's great. Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I didn't do anything. Yeah, I didn't either. I guess we'll find out. I, yes, you will. You seem like a dick. Like, why are you, why are you being like a dick? Like, I'm a self control. I'm like, I'm, like, why are you being like this? Why? I'm not sure what you think I'm being why, like. Why are you being a dick? Why? Why? Huh? Why? I, I don't understand. If he comes and he feels like that you're good to go, you're gone. I'll see you later. Yeah, if not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Okay, I guess okay. that's what you think. I, no, I know. All right. You're so fucking pompous. Okay. You're pompous. You're right. You are. Sure. You 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 just like come back like oh, but you're a dick. Like it's so fucking pompous. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. Oh, uh, like you're like, oh, you are like, no, you're pompous. No, I'm just trying to direct lights, like uh, people okay, into the okay, Christmas okay, lights. Okay. Yeah, you're right. I am right. I guess we'll see. Yes, we will. Sure. No, okay. Oh. The officers suspected her of driving under the influence, DUI, due to the smell of alcohol emanating from her and her inability to complete basic tasks during sobriety tests. Despite repeated attempts to reason with her, she adamantly denied any wrongdoing and resisted arrest, resulting in charges of DUI, resisting arrest, and battery on a law enforcement officer. Great answer. At that time, so I smelled the odor of alcohol. I said, I'm, I'm turning. I, I, did a quick I said, I'm turning. I yes, I did Family. say I'm turning. I'll, I'll, I'll listen to what you have to say. So, so that's how we got here. So I had her pull over on the side of the road. At first, she so was like, your, she, sorry, when you took her license, she was, I couldn't hear I said, I'm turning. She still the license. Wait, please. I want to listen to him, and I'm going to talk to you then. She okay. couldn't give me a straight answer. I smelled the odor of alcohol at beverages. Okay. Here we are now. I did a quick You're HGN. Stupid. You're stupid. I saw I jump, full extension. That's what made me go. All right, you pull over. Okay. So, and then we've been sitting here. I so. said, I am pulling over. You right. know you, I said that. Uh, you know, no, you said. You thought about not. Uh, no, I'm not. Didn't okay. say not. All right, that's not. fine. This is Corporal Schwartz. I'm Corporal Robinson. Okay. So, Corporal Schwartz is going to talk to you. Okay. Ma'am, do you want to just walk back and talk I to me? I don't want to do anything. Here? You don't want to do anything? Okay. No. Uh, at this point, because he's being belligerent. Well, I'm I'm gonna walk no, away he's, with you. He, okay, I'm gonna separate he is you being, from. I'm he is being belligerent. I'm okay. not doing anything with him. Okay, I'm gonna no, separate. No, I'm not being with him. Can you please stop interrupting me? I said I was going to separate you from him. You can come back with me and talk to me. Okay? No, I don't want to do anything with you. Well, you you're gonna need to. No, I'm not gonna do anything with, with you. Me. Okay. I can smell the alcohol oh, coming yeah, out of your yeah, breath. Yeah, yeah, you you say that because he said no, that. No, I can smell it because you're talking and the wind I, is blowing directly into my face. It's not any alcohol. Do you feel the wind at your back? Well, yes, that wind, I I'm feel standing it. right in front of I you. I have no alcohol on me. Nothing, nothing. Go ahead. Blow, 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 go ahead. Okay, would you like to, would you like to no, perform some you. field no, coordination no, exercises? No, Okay. Because I've done this before. No, thank you. No, thank you. May I please look at your eyes? Yes. But I have to say, I have my my. What? What's wrong? I have issues of my. With what? With my like medical stuff. You have, you have a disability? Yes. So what would that so be? So don't do any, like, that. Don't do that. Do what? Don't do the thing with the thing with the thing. What thing with the thing? No, don't do that. Because I have...
So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to check out your eyes, okay? No, it's don't very easy. do that. We don't do that because it is my disability. Like, I do have... What's what's the disability that prevents you no, from being able to look at a panel? No, I don't want to say it because I've done this before. Her subsequent breathalyzer test revealed a blood alcohol content of over three times the legal limit, solidifying the DUI charge. I really do need you to yell right now. Are you? Are you? Are you? I haven't made that decision. Yet. Are you? I'm here to investigate a Are you? criminal matter that I I did not to. do anything wrong. Nobody did anything to you. You made the decisions you made. I didn't do anything. Okay. I didn't do so anything. So, if you didn't do anything, right? I didn't do anything. You do some field sobriety exercises, you pass with flying okay. colors, you leave. Can, nobody can pass those things. Nobody can. I'm sorry? Nobody can. Nobody can what? Pass those things. Plenty of people pass them. No, they don't. I'm not they, stupid. They do all the time. They don't. They, do. they don't. Where were you headed to, Tom? My friend's house. Your friend's house? Yes. Where are you coming from? From my house. Where's that? My house. Why do you want to know? I'm just curious. No, you're trying to get do you, do you have uh, an idea no. where you live? Yeah, I know where I live. Where is it? And I know where I'm going. Can you do me a favor? Do you know how to... No, stop. Do, you, do your fingers work? Stop. Do your fingers work? Why, why are you trying to make me... Can you do, do... something <laughs> no. very simple? Like, no. one, no. two, no. three, four, because you're, you're trying four, to make three, me do two, something. One. You're trying to make me do something. Okay. Um, Angelique, I'm going to be, I'm going to be up front with you, okay? My, I am up yeah. front. I am up front. Like, yes, I'm trying to come from my house to their house. Yes, I am. The way you're acting, in but conjunction with... But you're not with, listening to me. I'm listening to you. I am. I'm trying to give you every opportunity in the world to show me that you are not intoxicated. And the incident escalated unnecessarily due to her combative demeanor and refusal to cooperate, leading to her arrest and legal repercussions. This Karen topped them all, you think? Think again after you see this, where case three, on December 30th, 2023, sheriffs responded to an airport disturbance involving a woman claiming to be a police officer, causing a commotion on a plane. The woman, displaying belligerent behavior, insisted on her rights and became confrontational with the sheriffs, ultimately leading to her arrest. Body cam footage captured the tense exchange, revealing the woman's refusal to cooperate and her persistent arguments. Get your Florida license. It's a medical marijuana card. Oh, sorry. It's this one. Sorry. They, I keep it in the same thing. Of course, my radio's in the truck. Can we bring it back over to my office? What's that? Can we bring it over to my office? Yeah, absolutely. Or, yeah, okay. Yeah. Want to grab your bag? Okay. I'm not carrying your stuff for you, so. I never asked. So oh, I, I know. said, okay, I'm carrying my stuff. Okay. So I hope you know. It's good. So am I. I'm recording everything too. I got a body worn right. camera. You already walked away, and as I'm collecting my things, you literally said, So you're not collecting your things as I'm collecting my things. That's not what I said. It already shows. Yes, it is. All I said is. shows you're not doing your job on top of that. I am doing my job right now. Yeah, I'm already under so, the police right. academy law. I already know what I'm talking about. You're under arrest about. for disorderly intoxication. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Right. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yep. You don't want to listen. You're intoxicated. And you're causing a scene at the airport. I literally. Okay, Place that's fine. My video literally Place. shows. Put your hand Sorry. down. Let me let me put this down. Let me put this down. Okay. Can I put this in my wallet? You put it down right there. With your put it down. restrooms. No, put I need it. to put this down so I know that it's in my restrooms. Ow! With Stop my, resisting and put it down. My hand Stop is resisting fully and put it down. incapitated with Damn. my thumb. Stop. That's fine. With this. You're fine. I hope you know. Put with that, that's what. No, that's fine. Will you stop? No, I'm not You're stopping. making this worse than... You just put an assault, which I have an injury on, that you put assault on top of. Yes. That's fine. I have everything on top of right there. I'm in the police academy. I know exactly what the law is. You're literally pulling everything against it, which no, is fine. I'm not. Yes, you are. 
you were in the police academy, you will not be anymore. I told you, I was putting my hands up against the police academy, everything. I told you I put my hands and then I put my hands up, and you didn't give me a single chance to put my evidence up for me to put my own personal propaganda against the ground. That is illegal propaganda. You're still causing a problem. No, I'm not. I literally just told you on the police airport right right there that that is the illegal propaganda. Can you guys grab her stuff so I can walk her up here, please? I'm not. You're literally going to be... You're causing a disturbance. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not, sir. We literally had to pull you off the plane. No, I do not. The moment you pull me off the plane was the moment I corresponded with everything that you said, corresponded with everything that was diligent, all of that fun stuff. So everything that you just did, you will be hearing with your own. Despite attempts to calm her down, the woman continued to challenge the sheriffs, demanding detailed explanations for her arrest. She adamantly denied causing any disturbance on the plane, asserting her innocence and knowledge of law enforcement protocols. However, her intoxicated state and combative demeanor only escalated the situation. At one center, I'll be at the security checkpoint. We have to take a female off the aircraft. I did not do that. Security checkpoint. Show me where I was kicking them, screaming, doing all that. Show me. There is no way that I am doing that. I'm literally about to go to the police force, everything. Like, there is literally no way that I am doing that. I'm literally trying to be as perfect as I can. Like, there's literally no way that I am doing that. See, I want to say, you can't be named day birth. L-E-I. Will you be quiet so I can talk on the radio? I have, to do, I have to do my last name first, so stop. Did I know that? Did I know that? Am I a police officer? Can yet? you stop? No. I'm literally telling you my information. Stop. I have it right here. Stop, please. Do I know that? No, you don't. So please ask me nicely. Hey, ma'am, I have this. Can you wait for this? Why is yeah, that I'm so bad? Her. She just won't be quiet. She won't be quiet. You would not ask me to be quiet. I shouldn't have to. That's a part of the job. And your part of the job is to what? Just yell at me? Peace. Somebody, somebody, Peace in somebody the who environment. is. Peace in stop. the environment. Peace somebody. in the environment. Yeah, Peace you're not gonna make in it the, the environment. Top, okay? And you keep talking over everybody. You have yet to let them speak or anything at all. That's peace over the environment. You need to stop. I literally let you know right there what your job is. Don't acrimate me on the job that I literally told you what everything that you just asked me is, and then you get mad at me for it. I'm ask trying to talk to the media. Ask me how you want it to be approached. Stop. Ask me how my Stop. name is. Ask me how anything is. That's how you do your fucking job. Thanks for letting me know how to do my you're job. Welcome. Yeah, Honestly, you're quiet, welcome. Honestly, you're welcome. Because instead of sitting there and just throwing out names and not having shit on any information that you have. Will you stop? So I'm I can talk on the radio. Now. Are you sure? Yeah. Did you get it all out? No. Yeah, now that I know that in your ear that they heard every fucking thing how your job actually is. You need to stop. I'm done. Do your actual job I on every it. fucking detail. I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. You she- straight up yelled at me, didn't ask me for any information on who I am or anything, and what? straight, no, 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 no. You I straight ready, right? yelled at me on this and this, and even though you had it all straight in your hand, you straight yelled at me for all the rest of my information. Come know. on. Yes, you did. You it's stop. on your car fucking video recorded. Can you, you stop think I now? make this up? Throughout the interaction, the woman insisted on her rights and berated the sheriffs for their handling of the situation. Despite their efforts to maintain control, the encounter remained contentious, with the woman accusing the sheriffs of mishandling her arrest. Is there anything on your channel about I'm, any guns, knives, bombs? No, okay. n- there's nothing. Any drugs? Once nothing you get to on the jail, me. If they find that on you, that's no, gonna be nothing. Call. Nothing. You okay. can literally search me on anything. He did not do his job. He did not search me on a single thing. Nothing before the airport. Nothing on even minimum on anything. Anything. I'm gonna switch cops. Yeah.
all because I questioned your you manhood. Question? Yeah, you did. That's not, that's not what you had is. everything fine with me until no. I literally questioned your fucking manhood. What are you talking yes, about? Yes, I did. No. Yes, I literally have it on video recordings. I had everything on you talking normal to me yep. until I literally questioned your job. And then you job. immediately went into my jobs, this and this and this. I have everything on recordings. Oh, it's, everything. It's, it's recording, but yes. No, it doesn't matter. Everything on police duty is recording. Just wait. Right. I, I, it doesn't matter. I hope, I hope you, you get fucked with the wrong person. You really did. I wouldn't try I me. warned you. I, it's not warning. It's not warning. I'm literally threatening you for the law. Okay. The law. In the end, the woman was arrested and escorted off the premises, still protesting her innocence. It's called disorderly intox. You're intoxicated. How is it disorderly intox? And it causes disturbance. That's fine. That's fine. It's a disturbance right now, but wait until well, I like, come there forward. Too. Wait until I come forward. And it's all fine. of them are going to come forward too. So I'm, that's, I'm, that's fine. Good. I have every witness. I have every family protocol. Everything coming forward. It's fine. Thank you. It's a whole fucking lawsuit. Okay. You're the one that kicked off the plane, not me. I'm because I'm of not, you no, and with your name and with your disorderly conduct and not breathalyzing me, not doing I anything. I don't have to do all that because on, I, can, I can tell yes, you're intoxicated. No, it doesn't matter. It Until totally on does. top, on top of everything that you have on top of paperwork. Hmm? Were you going to the academy? Is that what you were doing? I'm gonna just pat you down, okay? It's not gonna be a thorough pat down. It's just, I'm just gonna make sure you don't have any guns on your waist, okay? Once you get to the job, they want to do a further pat down. Can we take your shoes off? Because they're padded.